Heavenly Father, Almighty God, I come before you today seeking refuge and strength in the midst of spiritual warfare. I am under siege by forces of darkness, by witchcraft spells, and demonic hindrances aiming to derail your divine plan for my life. Yet, in the full armor of God, I stand resolute, grounded in the truth, that I overcome every operation of witchcraft by the blood of the Lamb and by the word of my testimony, as declared in Revelation 12, 11. I affirm, with every breath in my body, to shine forth. I echo this divine invocation, asking for your righteous vengeance to speak against every agent of witchcraft, laboring against my breakthrough. Let the fire of your justice expose and consume the works of darkness aimed at my life. Your vengeance is pure, holy, and righteous, and in your justice I find peace. In the authority of your word, I command every evil altar erected against my progress to be consumed by the fire of God, as Elijah demonstrated on Mount Carmel in 1 Kings 18, 38. Let your holy fire descend from heaven and destroy every binding spell, every curse, and every incantation that has been pronounced against me. As these altars are shattered, let the chains they forged in the spiritual realm break, releasing my breakthrough in Jesus' name. I stand on the promise of Isaiah 54, 17, declaring no weapon formed against me shall prosper. Every evil decree, every spoken word aimed at my downfall is nullified by the authority vested in me through Christ Jesus. Your word is my shield and my fortress, a legal document that invalidates the enemy's plans and establishes your kingdom's rule over my life. Lastly, O oh Lord, I seek a spiritual cleansing that only your spirit can provide. Create in me a clean heart, O oh God, and renew a right spirit within me, as implored by David in Psalm 51. 10. Let the precious blood of Jesus, which speaks better things than that of Abel, cleanse me from every deposit of witchcraft, every taint of the enemy's touch. Purify my heart, my mind, and my spirit, filling me anew with your Holy Spirit, that I may walk in freedom, light, and truth. As I lift this prayer to you, O Lord, I do so with unwavering faith, knowing that the weapons of our warfare are not carnal, but mighty through God, to the pulling down of strongholds. 2 Corinthians 10, 4. I am more than a conqueror through him who loves me. Thank you. Father, for the victory that is mine in Christ Jesus. In his precious name, I pray. Amen. O sovereign Lord, my refuge and my deliverer, in the authority of your word and the mighty name of Jesus, I approach your throne of grace and mercy. I am beset by forces that seek to entangle my life in chains of darkness through witchcraft and malicious spells. Yet, in you, I find my victory and deliverance, cleansing from witchcraft deposit. Create in me a clean heart, O God, and renew a right spirit within me, as David cried out in Psalm 51, 10. Lord, I beseech you to let the sanctifying blood of Jesus Christ cleanse every nook and cranny of my being, washing away every deposit of witchcraft, May your living water flow through my spirit, soul, and body, purifying me from every defilement. Divine shield of protection. Lord, you promise in Psalm 91. For to cover me with your feathers, and under your wings I shall find refuge. Be my shield and my fortress against every witchcraft spell cast in the shadows. May your presence encamp around me, a divine protection. 
that no dark force can penetrate. Breaking generational curses in the mighty name of Jesus. I stand against every generational curse linked to witchcraft in my family line, as acknowledged in Exodus 25. By your power, I declare these chains shattered and broken. Let the cycle of curses end with me, as I step into the light of your promise and provision, silencing the accuser. Lord, according to Titus 2, 8, let the mouth of every witchcraft accuser be silenced. May the truth of your word stand firm in my life, acting as a shield against every false accusation and condemning voice. In the courtroom of heaven, I declare my cause justified by the blood of the Lamb, reversing evil spells. Every spell, every hex, and every curse sent my way. I command in the name of Jesus to be reversed and returned to sender, as Solomon wisely observed in Proverbs 26, 27, whoever digs a pit will fall into it. Let the trap set for me become the snare for those who laid them, unlocking divine doors. I declare open doors and divine breakthroughs in every area of my life, as promised in Revelation 3, 8. No spell, no hex, and no barrier can close what you, O oh Lord, have opened for me. May the doors of opportunity, favor, and divine destiny swing wide open, ushering me into your plan and purpose, healing from witchcraft attack. Lord, according to your word in Jeremiah 17, 14, heal me, O oh Lord, and I shall be healed. Let your healing virtue flow through every area of my life that has suffered under the weight of witchcraft attacks. Restore my strength, my joy, and my peace, that I may testify of your goodness. As I lift these prayers to you, I do so with faith in your word, which is alive and powerful, sharper than any two-edged sword. I trust in your promise to deliver me from the snare of the fowler and from the deadly pestilence. You are my refuge and my fortress, my God, in whom I trust. In the mighty and matchless name of Jesus Christ, I pray. Amen.